Okay, don't fit. Uh, wrong size picture frame. <laughs> Six months later, we will be looking at my first short film called Sun. Enjoy. Okay, okay. You ready? All right. You got the snacks? Snacks? Okay. Drinks? All right. Thank you. And surround sound system. Mm -hmm. All right. You are great. Now we are ready to begin. I didn't know where else to go. I never really had a father. Well, man gets. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna talk about is how I wrote the script. This part right here, where we're at the boathouse, is actually a spot in Brooklyn. We were in Prospect Park at that boathouse, and we asked two strangers, based on the items we have, which was a knife and money, and the location, what story should we tell? And they were like, son, well, with the boathouse and the cash, you should do a story about somebody killing somebody for business. And I was like, hmm, we got this. So this fella and I just improved for a couple of scenes and then we finally got a story structured out where his dad kills my dad and I'm there to get some type of revenge. After that was all said and done, I had this camera and a tripod. This tripod! And I had myself and no other team to help me do this. So I was like, what can I do to add on to this scene? Because I like it. So I looked out the window and I thought to myself, if I'm going to potentially hurt someone like I did in that improv scene, what would a day in the life of that character be like? And why was he pushed to do the things he did? So I got out the camera and I shot a whole film, 16 and something minutes long. Let's see, 16 and 46 seconds long. And I want you guys, if you have an idea, no matter what, no matter how limited your crew is or your equipment, go out there and shoot that thing because you are gonna learn so much. And that's what I'm gonna tell you next. The first thing I learned was that you cannot let anything limit you. If you have a story, tell it. Uh, sometimes you can plan, but sometimes you should just shoot it guerrilla style and go out there and capture it and piece it together. So this was my first time doing post production stuff and I would like to give my thanks to anyone in the post production world because you guys are amazing and talented people and you guys are magic because going through this I had to deal with color and then I was like wait how do I do this and then I had to watch videos and audio and a whole bunch of other things and i'm just saying to have a team does take the load off but this was for me to learn so i'm happy the way it came out do i see this as a potential feature film i do there's so much i can build around these two characters and the world that they are in and how their family gets affected by these decisions so yeah 
As far as acting and character goes, there's so much I learned about this and the process I took on to get those emotions and to get the story out. First off, I want to say I went really deep on this process and I thought, okay, somebody killed my father and killing off my parents made me have sleepless nights. I'm talking about nights where I couldn't sleep. I was rolling around. I had really crazy anxiety where I started picking on my skin because I was like, okay, my parents just died. Somebody killed them. Somebody killed my dad. And I started picking my, my skin and I couldn't sleep and... I was a really stressful time. I didn't think it would affect me that bad. So I would say one, be careful. And if you're not careful and you just want to create art and get to a headspace that you believe is needed, do it. Because I commend artists for that. We step in to our own wounds and we pour salt on them and we just rip them open even more for ourselves and to give the world something of, of us you know i will let you guys judge the film rate it i will let you guys let me know what you guys think of how i did the film and how the character was you know i'll be honest with you there's a lot of things from that character that was fun to mess around with Where like, like his slow walk and i kind of the way he just was agitated at everything around him, you know, was was something nice to switch into, to see in the eyes of people who are really like him. I hope you guys enjoyed, learned a lot. If you guys have any questions about film, acting, or the this film, Son, let me know. Guys! That being said, I do have a second film that is coming out you soon that you can you. find clips all over the oh, internet yeah. from. It is called Aluta Romania. Check it out. I love you guys. Have a nice day.